Wizards, meanwhile, have been off since Tuesday when they fell to the Pistons at home, 117-97, as Porzingis and Mobley step to the center circle. The tip is won by Mobley, and we are underway. That shot can win the Cavs a game. Now on this end, the 6-8 Stevens will guard the 7-3 Porzingis as Gafford sends it inside to Porzingis. Porzingis lays it in. Cavs wearing their City Edition uniforms, the tan and light blue wins. Garland picks the pocket of Kuzma. Garland off to the races through Morris. Hits Mitchell. Mitchell will drive and hammer it. Cavaliers got him scrambling. Barton is no longer a wizard. He was waived, acquired by the Raptors. Garland off to Mobley. Frees him up gorgeously, and Mobley does the rest. Fields watched by Garland. Thought about a Gafford screen. Zigzags his way down the lane and gets it to go. I don't know what's going on all of a sudden in the NBA. Beal, nice for the basket, puts it up. Mobley was there. Gafford, however, with the finish, he dunks. It's amazing how agile he is, man. He, he can cover a lot of ground. Mitchell off to Mobley. Wow, he finds Stevens. How about that passing? Stevens dunks, gets fouled, and has a chance for the three-point play. Mitchell works on Kuzma. Stevens thought about it. Stevens dumps off to Okoro now. Back to Garland. Garland, a hesitation move, gets inside, puts it up, and puts it in. An acrobatic move by Darius Garland. He's been good defensively throughout the season. That offense has really kicked in as well over the last couple of weeks. Porzingis for three. Kristaps has nine. Curl to the corner, set up shot, keep his dribble. Now deal to Levert, who relays to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell in toward Avdia, draws a crowd, puts it up, gets continuation, and Mitchell has a chance for the three-point play. Kuzma to the basket, he raced by Mobley. Ooh, he ate that shot up. Get that big stuff out of here. Levert to the basket, he puts it up and in. Levert out here with Garland in the backcourt as Garland works it off to Diakite. Diakite put it up. Gafford with the block. Garland appeared to get hit in the face as Oswald just keeps the shot clock and banks it in. He knew he didn't have much time left, so he made a nice little push shot to the board. Right, a good move as he ducked under Diakite. He's able to get back fairly soon as Diakite works toward the basket. Out to Levert. Levert fires. It's tipped and eventually tracked down by Garland as Garland goes to Diakite who lays it in. Yes. Garland with a no-look dish for his fourth assist. Right and Kispert. Kispert in close quarters just took that handoff and launched. As Garland goes back to Diakite, comes and gets it. Cavs by six. Garland to the bucket. Cavs by eight and a chance for nine. Instead, take a drifting shot. Missed it. Diakite couldn't haul it in. Gaffer gets there. Dumps it back toward Davis. Picked off by Lavert. Lavert all the way. Rubio's doing a good job. You can see he's getting used to playing with that uh, injury now because it's really moving. He's moving well laterally. He's only appeared in 15 games and 88 combined minutes. This is rookie season. Garland off to Mobley. Boy, what a terrific little pass in tight quarters to set up the Mobley dunk. He attacked Porzingis that time. That's what you have to do against a guy who's 7'3", 7'4". Beal tried to initiate the contact into Mobley. Did that. He thought he got fouled. He just stands there as Mitchell goes right past. Five on four. Mitchell wheels to the basket. Puts it up and in. Donovan Mitchell makes Porzingis and the Wizards pay. How the brings the right attitude to the floor. Beal down the alley. He got fouled. Puts it up and in. And Beal has a chance for three. <laughs> you know, if things go against you, you're yeah. going to get a little upset. Sure. Inside is Mobley and upset Porzingis with the rejection. Garland gets it back for the Cavs. Double clutches. What a move by Garland. Garland's a torrid six for seven here in the first half. Mitchell with a steal. Here goes Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell to the basket. Puts it up and puts it in. The footwork is terrific. Yes. Sometimes you forget he's only 21 years of age. That's right. Beal accelerates in toward a Coro. Tough shot. Deals picked up by Garland on the switch. Coro shows double. It's dribbled off a foot up ahead to Garland. That's going to work out. That's all it was, a little bit of defense. Jared Allen remaining out of the lineup. You said it, AC, the Cavs coughed it up only four times. Points off turnovers, 15-2. Cavaliers as Porzingis tries to get a rip-through move. He got it. Morris. That goes for a drifting jumper, which is way short. That was well defended as 
And out comes Darius Garland. He probes down the middle of the floor. Nobody stopped him. Mobley dunks. Gets fouled by Beal. And Mobley has a chance for three. Porzingis is watched by Stevens. Lobs to Beal. Inside it goes to Morris for a short jumper. <laughs> Morris, a hesitation move. Left it short. Garland with the rebound. Garland the other way. Bounces to Steve. Oh, Stevens got slapped hard by Kuzma. Got it over the rim and gets it to go. They came out of the locker room. The Wizards had a little energy. The Cavs are starting to answer that energy now. Beal on a drive. Beal now has 19. That's a team high. Yeah, as Mitchell took a bump from Beal. Kispert pulls the trigger. Going into that fourth quarter. Moves the ball, especially to the weak side. Rubio underneath, puts it up and in. He snuck it around Porzingis. And Wes Unseld wants a timeout. Cavaliers, meanwhile, own this 11-point lead. Porzingis looks to penetrate, bumps into Diakite, banks and scores. Levert shakes on Davis. Levert curls toward the corner, now goes baseline again and banks it home. About an 11 second difference between shot clock and game clock. Right into Mobley it goes, out to Levert. Levert a nice play to keep it in bounds. Levert into Mobley, Ooh. Mobley crutches it home and Porzingis talked Levert out of the shot. Start of the fourth quarter, Ricky Rubio, Evan Mobley, Karis Levert, Darius Garland, and Jetty Osmond are on the floor. Mobley threw an arm of Gafford, puts it up and in, and Mobley has a chance for the three-point play. 60. Osmond with a strip, took it away from Gafford. Mobley, Levert takes the feed from Garland and hammers it home. Defense the offense, that's when they're at their best. Cavaliers have been doing this to teams over and over and over again. 23 or more points off turnovers in five straight games. They're now at 19 this evening. Kuzma hits his first shot of the night. Mobley for the foul line, bounces to Rubio behind the back, around the horn. Here's Garland, Garland to the paint, finger rolls and scores. Garland, Rubio, Mobley, Okoro, and Levert make up the Cavalier five as Rubio had it batted right back at him. Off the Garland for three, got it. Darius says, finally. That is something you do not see a lot in today's game. Right. Gill hesitates, <laughs> thought about it twice, says, you take it, Morris, and Monte drills it. Just turn to the corner with Mobley in that lane. Now Mobley is out there for the potential field three. Doesn't shoot that. Kuzma inside up here to change his pivot foot, and he banks it in. We approach the midway point of the fourth quarter. Cavaliers 98, Wizards 85. They're going into an out, all-and-out all out zone now. He'll defend poor Zingas on this end. Poor Zingas lobs inside for Kuzma. Kuzma, got it. And it gets the Cavs back into executing mode. The Wizards stay in zone. The Cavs go to Mobley at the foul line. Mobley missed the first shot, directs in the second. Wes Unseld wants a timeout. 4.05 to go. Mitchell glides to the basket and plugs it home. Finger roll across the middle. Now a steal by Levert. Levert to Garland. Garland lays it in. Yes. Winner saw some action in Charlotte as Neto finds Windler. Windler for three. Hey, got it. Dylan Windler deep in the rock. Kendrick Nunn. He seems to be playing fear. Nunn went from Miami to L.A. He was picked up on a trade with the Lakers in January for Rui Hachimura as Danny Green knocks it down before the game. Defense wins championships, Austin Carr. That's ex right. That's exactly right. And, and, and that's what the Cavaliers are showing. Good signs are starting to really tighten in on their defensive efforts, and they've become a much better offensive team when they do that.